there's nothing subtle about a Lamborghini. They're among the boldest and brashest high-performance vehicles in the world, existing as rolling works of art for truly affluent, and attention-hungry, aficionados with a need for speed. Ferruccio Lamborghini founded the company that bears his name in 1963, and headquartered it in the Italian village of Sant'Agata Bolognese as an extension of his then-successful tractor-building business. As a lover of bulls and born under the sign of Taurus, Lamborghini adopted a bull as his corporate symbol, and many of the company's models have a connection to famed fighting bulls. Lamborghini Urus Yes, just like virtually every automaker on the planet Lamborghini has an SUV as part of its lineup. Though the Urus is arguably the brand's only model that can legitimately be used as a daily driver, it's no ordinary suburban car pooler. That's because it packs a 4.0-liter twin-turbo V8 that generates 650 horsepower and allows acceleration to 100 kilometers, 62 miles per hour, at a brief 3.5 seconds. Top speed is 189 miles per hour. Standard all-wheel drive combines with active torque vectoring, four-wheel steering, an adaptive air suspension, active roll stabilization, and carbon ceramic brakes to ensure uncanny handling capabilities. Selectable driving modes enable the Urus to be as at home around town as it would be off-road or at the track. And yes, there is a cattle connection. Urus, also known as Aurochs, is one of the large, wild ancestors of domestic cattle. Lamborghini Huracan Evo RWD The rear-wheel drive Lamborghini Huracan replaced the long-standing Gallardo in the lineup for the 2015 model year. As follows Lambo's long-time styling trend, it's wedge-shaped with dramatic creases and curves running from front to rear. It meets performance expectations with a mid-mounted 5.2-liter 610 horsepower V10 engine that's good for a 0 to 62 miles per hour, 0 to 100 kilometers, run in a little over 3 seconds, and a maximum speed of 202 miles per hour. Lamborghini says the car's rear-wheel drive configuration promises a pure driving experience, and at a somewhat lower price than either of the all-wheel drive Huracan Evo variants. It makes extensive use of aluminum and carbon fiber to reduce weight. Individual driving modes are selected via a steering wheel mounted anima button, it stands both for adaptive network intelligent management, and the word soul in Italian. Lamborghini Huracan STO The latest variation of the Huracan, the STO, it stands for Super Trofeo Amalogata, is essentially a street-legal Lamborghini race car. The STO's V10 engine generates a fiery 640 horsepower without resorting to supercharging or turbocharging and enables a 0 to 62 miles per hour run in 3 seconds and a top speed of about 193 miles per hour. Extensive use of lightweight materials, advanced aerodynamics, Formula 1 inspired brakes, four-wheel steering and a magnetic adaptive suspension complete the street racer experience. The Lamborghini Vehicolo Dynamica Integrata Vehicle Dynamic System optimizes the car's performance over curved roads, enables quick lap times and improves its dynamics over wet pavement. Lamborghini Huracan Evo AWD As the name implies, this is the all-wheel drive version of the rear-wheel drive Huracan Evo, and like that model it comes in coupe and spider convertible versions, but with added muscle. It borrows the 5.2-liter V12 engine from the Huracan Performante and channels 640 horses to the pavement. The coupe can sprint to 62 miles per hour in 2.9 seconds, while the Spider will make it in a slightly tardier 3.1 seconds, each with a top speed of 201 miles per hour. The car's handling benefits from rear-wheel steering and a four-wheel torque vectoring system. A set of integrated sensors mounted at the center of gravity monitors and adjust the adaptive suspension dampers in real time. As with all Lambos, extensive avenues for customization are available. Lamborghini Huracan Performante The Huracan Performante Coupe and Spider variants run hot with the 640 horsepower 5.2 liter V12 engine it shares with the aforementioned Evo AWD model. The Performante likewise rides on an all-wheel drive platform and includes an active aerodynamic system to maximize its downforce on both the open road and a closed track. It can reach a top speed of around 202 miles per hour. The coupe can hit the 62 miles per hour mark in a brief 2.9 seconds, with the convertible at 3.1 ticks. The Performante structure is both light in weight and is extra sturdy, thanks to its hybrid aluminum and carbon fiber frame, and aluminum body panels. An active aerodynamic system, called Aerodynamica Lamborghini Ativa, helps reduce drag to further enhance the vehicle's performance at various speeds. Lambo's Anima 3-mode driving dynamic system includes a Corsa mode for high performance and racetrack driving. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. 
Thank you for watching.